Hey, what is up you guys? It's Megan. Welcome back to my channel PG Squad. Today I am so excited because Adopt Me released a brand new update being the Butterfly Sanctuary update. Now, if you're new here, welcome. If you're old here, you know that I am a huge, huge fan of butterflies. They're behind here. They're here. They're in my hair every day. I have, ooh, wrong arm. I have multiple butterfly tattoos. I even have, <sighs> yeah, this is dangerous. I have a, a one right here. Um, I have butterflies all around my room. I like just, they are everywhere in my life. I am a huge butterfly fan. So this is going to be one of my favorite Adopt Me updates. I already know it. So if we are so excited, please make sure you hit the like button, subscribe button, and use star code Megan Plays whenever you are buying Robux for this, uh, I almost called it expansion for this update. It's not an expansion pack. God, Megan, how old are you? Okay, so here I am in Adopt Me. Very excited. Um, oh, cash out, baby. I just gave Honey a cure-all potion and he's already sick and needs to go to the hospital. So the title does not deceive any of us. I do have to update the thumbnail after the stream, but I have acquired I'm out of breath. I was so excited for the butterfly update. I have acquired, um, oh, Snowy Place, thank you so much for becoming a member of the PG Squad. I've acquired 100 golden leaves. And this was all by myself. These were not gifted to me. Let me go, let me show you guys. Um, <sighs> ew, sorry. <laughs> um, currency purchases, is that what I did? No, ooh, no, okay, uh, purchases. Gonna show you guys my purchase history. It's loading, okay. So as we can see, we are the ones who purchased 100. This is why I had to offset the stream by 30 minutes for the update, because as we can see, I started buying these like as soon as this update came out. Like I started buying them as soon as the update came out and it took me all the way until the stream started to buy them all because that's how long it took to buy 100 of them okay let's move this back over here i need to go back um da -ba -da -da -da. okay okay there you guys are <laughs> hello okay so i'm excited i can't wait um i wish that i had another cure-all potion for honey but instead i think i'm just gonna put him down for a nap because <laughs> He's a little stinky, you know? And you know you know he likes to take naps. All right, let's find this elusive butterfly sanctuary and get the butterflies. They're all mine. And then also I know that there's some butterflies for bucks. So I have not seen the butterfly sanctuary. I haven't done any of that yet. Um, this is my absolute first time checking any of it out. I barely even watched the video announcing it because I kind of just wanted to I just kind of wanted to like check it all out. Um, okay. <laughs> Hello everybody, I'm so happy that you guys are here. Um, Grace, hi Megan, you're so pretty excited for the update. Have a great day. Thank you for being subscribed for 11 months, Grace. Are you the one who messaged me uh, on Twitter today letting me know that your thing expired? If it expires, that's okay too. <laughs> All right, so here is the beautiful butterfly sanctuary. It leaves in 13 days, so you guys have two weeks to play this. Now, Adopt Me has prefaced this update saying it is an update and the thing that keeps Adopt Me fun is not getting everything at once. We know that's not how I function. I like to get everything at once, but that is not how they intend uh, for the game to be played. They intended to be played over long spans of time. So if it's all unobtainable, um, it's by design. Let's get into it. <laughs> you love butterflies too? <gasps> mm, it's so beautiful. <gasps> the pink one, the red one. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, okay. Oh, it's giving Animal Crossing. The Animal Crossing Butterfly Sanctuary is my favorite spot. Mm. I, so I don't like to talk about things before they're happening, but very, very soon, Zach and I should have a yard again. Very soon. So I need all of your thoughts and prayers. If you pray, if you just put positive vibes into the universe, I could use all those directed towards me and Zach because hopefully we will have a yard again soon for the dogs. And um, I want to get a butterfly hutch so I can um, help, so I can help like, um, not grow, but, or breed, that's a weird word. I, so I can help butterflies have a safe place to 
go from being caterpillars to butterflies um, because monarch butterflies are an endangered species, I believe. So I would really like to help um, by, <laughs> by giving butterflies a safe place to exist. I hope that makes sense. I don't really know the right verbiage. So I'm very excited. Okay, so here we go, guys. Oh, diamond butterfly, 2.5%. So we have the leaf here for 900 bucks. If we do some quick math, quick calculations, you'll need six, seven, eight. So basically don't even bother getting all these because that's gonna be too much. Get the good old calculator out. Oh gosh. Get the good old calculator out. So we got a uh, 600 plus 200. Oh wait, no, 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 wrong, 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 wrong. 280 plus 95 plus 95 plus 24. If you want to go it that way, you're going to spend 1,095 Robux, or you could spend 650 Robux um, and get you'll have 500 bucks left over. So um, I guess maybe if you bought like. You could get like two or three. You could get three if you bought two of these. Okay, I hope that makes sense. So they have the yellow butterfly for 60%, scarlet butterfly for 37.5%, and the purple butterfly for 2.5%, which is exciting. And then we have the golden leaf, the orange butterfly, 60%, green butterfly, 37% and the diamond butterfly 2.5%. Butterfly, uh, I'm gonna be doing 100 of the golden ones, um, but Let's try throwing one of these out just to see. So here we can see the orange, the red, and the purple butterfly. We got ourselves mm, yummy leaves. Do butterflies don't even eat leaves. Caterpillars eat leaves, right? <laughs> okay. I mean, it would have been cute if we threw out a flower, right? Okay. No, I'm not criticizing. Yellow. So 60% we got ourselves a yellow butterfly. Let's go ahead and try to just get a few of these going. Oh, is that the diamond butterfly? The blue one right there? Okay, we got another. So this, it's gonna take a while to collect them all. And honestly, I think they're so cute. I was, I don't wanna use the word disappointed, but when they introduced the first butterfly in the game, I was like, why is it named like Uplift Butterfly? Like, I, like 2021, I just felt like it was not justice. Oh, we got a scarlet one. So that's the 37% chance. And then let's see if, like, I think getting the purple one will be really difficult. So I probably won't be able to get that one on stream, but um, that's okay. We're, we're, gonna, we're gonna be doing a lot of golden. Okay, another scarlet. So there's the green. I think that one is the, the diamond one. I wonder what it looks like in the daytime. All right. Ugh, okay, sorry, I'm like really addicted to trying to get these. I'm like, oh, just one more, just one more, just one more. The scarlet one is so cute. Look at them, guys. Okay, cute, cute, cute. And they fly around and just give me a purple. Okay, no. <gasps> See, Monarch! So that must be the one that you get the 60%. They just named it Orange Butterfly. Oh my gosh, a baby. Okay, food, let's get going guys with the 100 butterflies. This is gonna take forever. Um, I do expect it to take somewhere around 40 minutes. Um, that's normally what it takes for me to record these videos. Uh, and it's normally just me sitting here quietly by myself. So I like that the orange butterflies, they have like this like curve, you know, like kind of like a monarch butterfly. Um, do monarch butterflies have those curves? <laughs> me referencing all my butterfly collections. No, they don't. They don't. I, like, I want to show you guys a little video of just looking around my office. So I have some butterflies there. I have some there, I have some there. I have a butterfly painting over there, and then I have more over there. Um, let me show you guys what I just filmed. <laughs> I have a butterfly painting over there, and then I have more How do I there. rewind this silly video? So, I have some butterflies there. See right there? I have some there. Right there. I have some there. I have a butterfly painting over My there. My grandma got me that. And then I have more over there. Um, so, I could see a monarch out of the corner of my eye. Oh my goodness. So, obviously, I'm obsessed. Okay, back to it. Oh, hello, pretty. Oh, look how its eyes. Oh, it's stinky. Oh. Embarrassing. Gotta go. <laughs> so there's the diamond ones. Those are pretty. 
Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ah! <laughs> oh baby, that is so pretty. Oh my gosh, wait, why am I tearing up right now? Oh. I'm just so happy. <laughs> Okay. Pull it together. We have 98 more of these to throw out. 98 more to throw out. Go, go, go. Okay, get a green one. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Look at the green one. So pretty. I can't believe we got six butterflies in the game. And I have them all except the purple one now. So adopt me, gift me a purple one. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. This is the best day of my life. This is the best day of my life. <laughs> oh, now they can bring me down. I swear. Adopt me. This is the best update ever. Look at this. Look at all this. Oh my gosh. Yummy leaves. Do butterflies eat leaves? Did you guys know that uh, <laughs> butterflies, they are scavengers. So they'll actually eat dead things. Like they'll eat like dead fish or dead animals. Um, they're scavengers. Did you know that? Bet you didn't know that. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mm, yummy leaves. What if, imagine if we were just throwing out like dead fish. Like meh. Cause I assure you guys, I know what I'm talking about. Butterflies also feed on fruit juice and tree sap. Um, and then in some cases, rotting fruit, insects, or animals. <laughs> oh my gosh. It says they act as scavengers. They're not actually scavengers, but just call it like I see it, guys. Just call it like I see it. Yummy leaves. This is the best day of my life. <laughs> Um, it's your two years as the PG squad. Nicole, thank you so much for all the love and support. Am I going on public service today? Yes. Oh, another diamond one. I am, but um, later, because I have to record some other videos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's great. That's good. <laughs> I want to climb the waterfall. Okay, I'm just so excited. It's such a good day. Oh, oops, okay, equip. Oh, I need to get closer to the butterflies. Okay, so you can't actually throw them. Oh, you can go over here, but you can't throw, I don't think, the thing from over here, right? That's kind of what I just gathered from that. Yeah, okay. So you can't throw them from over here, but that's okay. We'll just go back over here. Look at all the butterflies. Wait, I have an inquiry. What if I threw this out? So what if I threw this out and then I got this and I threw that out? Oh, no, okay. You can't do both interactions at once. You can only do one interaction at a time. Okay, that makes sense. That's fine. Oh look, it's the orange, the yellow, the, okay, right? It's yellow? Yeah, yellow. The yellow, the scarlet, and the purple. I wonder when I'll get a purple. I guess I'll have to like, like I really gotta double up on this double duty. Ooh, green! Oh my gosh. Your dog's a cavapoo like Peach, and your dog is called Buddy, that is so cute. Thank you for letting me know. I love cavapoos. 
A suggestion for the yellow. Sunny, I like that. Are diamond butterflies a thing? No, I don't think so, but there's a butterfly and I think it's really pretty. It's one of my favorites. I'll show you. As it's embarrassing because as obsessed as I am with butterflies, I don't really know a lot of the names of a lot of them. Um, I would like to study more, but at the same time, I just don't have a lot of time. But um, this, I think, would be the closest one to a real life diamond butterfly. See, I think it's like, I'll have to double check the name before I just say something, but you guys can see. Ooh, this one's an Animal Crossing. It's like a tiger butterfly, right? So it's just one of the one of the things I have. And the back of it, it's like camouflaged. It's got little eyes so that um, predators, when it sees it, might think it's not just a delectable butterfly. <laughs> let's see, I'll look up the name of that one real quick because I, let's see. Um, it's called, no, not that one, not that one. <sighs> I'm like lightheaded. Morpho, that's what it's looking like. It's looking like it's a Morpho butterfly. Let's see, Morpho butterfly, Morpho butterfly. Yeah, it's embarrassing because Oh, you guys can't even see what I'm looking at. <laughs> I, I was looking at the butterflies and then I clicked on this. <laughs> Look at all these! <gasps> oh my gosh. Hello. They're so expensive. Butterfly Utopia. Oh my gosh. Gosh, I'm gonna have a heart attack. I'm gonna have a heart attack. <gasps> okay, sorry, back to the video. Oh my gosh, end this madness. What do you want from me? Please. <laughs> like drooling. <laughs> okay, and then look guys, this, my sister got me this necklace and I wear it every day. It's got a butterfly on it. She surprised me with it. And my sister also got me this candle holder. See? <laughs> so cute! Sorry. <laughs> okay, back to business. Oh gosh, we still have a long way to go. I, I'm too distracted. How rare is the green? Let's go look. That's a great question. I don't know. Um, the green is a 37.5% chance um, of the 200 Robux Golden Leaf. Name the green butterfly Jade. Okay. Jade. Oh, another green. We like that. It's your first day of school tomorrow? What grade, what grade are you going in? That sounds fun. I really miss school. I want to go back to school. <laughs> um, even though in college I got really depressed. <laughs> I was still, I still um, enjoyed learning and um, the knowledge I really did enjoy. Bubblegum is cute for the Scarlet one. I agree. I agree. That is a cute name. My favorite Stranger Things character. Everyone always asks me this and I don't give it too much thought, but I really like Dustin because he's very smart. And we stand somebody with knowledge and brains. So I think Dustin is like one of my favorites. We got another diamond. Ah, this is so exciting. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> name one wings. Okay, okay. I don't want to name them all right now because I want to keep them like kind of in their categories here so I can see how many of each we end up with after the stream so I can check the percentages on them. You know what I mean? 
So. Going into the eighth grade, I really liked the eighth grade. I did like that year. I was really coming into who I was as a person in the eighth grade. Um, GG eighth grade, yeah. Is the green butterfly legendary? That's a great question. Let's see. So yeah, all of the ones, all of the ones that you can buy with Robux are legendary, but the ones you buy for bucks, the yellow is rare. Um, and the red <laughs> is ultra rare. And I wonder if we look at the journal here, if we can see what rarity the uh, the purple is. Ultra rare. So the purple is actually ultra rare. Wait. Oh, I have a neon. I have I have a neon uplift butterfly. It's cute. Oh my gosh. I wouldn't. I wonder what the differences are in this one and then the other ones. Like the uplift butterfly has little like. Balls has feet. These don't have any feet. These don't have any feet. Doink. You have butterfly earrings? That's cool. I'm jealous. I don't have any butterfly earrings. Ninth grade? Ooh, freshman. That's gonna be fun. High school was so fun. Um, you're scared to go to the 10th grade? No, the 10th grade? That's a good year too. Hi, Bubble Plays. You're moving up to the fourth grade? That's so cool. I don't remember much of the fourth grade. I think I gained a lot of consciousness going into the fifth grade. That's where a lot of my core memories started forming. <laughs> um, oh, you guys are so sweet. I'm just like reading all your comments. Uh, Megan Slavot, don't worry, I will get my own purple butterfly, but thank you so much for the offer. You love the puff ears? Thank you, you can get them at staypeachy.com. I think we're having a huge sale right there right now, so that's pretty good stuff. <laughs> Go! Oh, I knew this was gonna take a while. <laughs> oh my goodness. Another green. Okay, we like it. We like it. Name for the diamond butterfly could be Sky. Yes, that's very pretty. How was my seventh grade year? It was pretty good. I, you know, so my school was divided up. So seventh and eighth grade for me were junior high. So my, I know a lot of schools do it differently, but my first school was like kindergarten through fourth, um, and that was primary school. And then I had fifth and sixth grade, which was elementary school. And then I had seventh and eighth grade, which was junior high. And then I had ninth through 12th grade, which was high school. Um, so junior high for me, the seventh and eighth grade, those were really good years for me. Um, of course you have your regular school drama, but I, looking back, I feel like I really came into like who I am as a person in those years. Um, I like found what type of music I really like to listen to. I found the way I really like to express myself through fashion in those years. Um, I really like, you know, I just kind of, had more of an opportunity to find out who I was. Um, so that was really fun. I think in the fifth and the sixth grade, not even like I think, like those were really hard years for me. I was just hanging out with like a crowd that I didn't fit in with because it was like an awkward time where it was like, oh, these are the people that I grew up with. These are the people I know. Um, but as we all kind of grew up, we didn't really have the same um, ideals, thoughts, and opinions, and I guess I would cling to this, like, friend that I grew up with, but it actually caused me a lot of pain because she became friends with, like, the most popular girl in school, and the most popular girl in school did not like me, um, so I was, like, kind of, like, bullied a lot, um, over that friendship, which really was hurtful, um, and so, yeah, fifth and sixth grade were hard for me, 
personally. I don't think it has anything to do with the age. It just was my situation. Um, and that's like whenever it's like, oh, you have to wear Abercrombie to be cool. You have to do this to be cool. And I would try to fit in into a place that I didn't really just fit in in. Like it was not my vibe. It was not who I was, but it's like what I knew my friends were doing, if that makes sense. So it's kind of where I thought I needed to be. Um, but it just wasn't. And then as I grew up and I went into the seventh and eighth grade, I just became more of myself. I started listening to the music I liked listening to more. Um, I didn't feel pressure to listen to like the mainstream music. I didn't feel pressured to wear like what everybody else was wearing. I kind of fell into a more alternative um, lifestyle fashion choices. Like, you know, I started shopping at like Hot Topic and um, listening to metal <laughs> and I just became like who I am today, which um, it's really cool. So, sorry, I'm just kind of blabbing. <laughs> um, my cats are doing fine. <laughs> my cats are doing great. But I guess what I want you guys to take from that is like, if you aren't having fun with a certain group of friends and you find yourself more upset with that group of friends or they're causing you a lot of pain to be with that group of friends or you're always feeling outcasted or laughed at or made fun of. That is not the group of friends for you. Um, and it's okay to set that boundary and maybe try to make some new friends because there are friends out there for everyone and it might not just be who you grew up down the street with, you know? So I think it's important to really put yourself out there and try to find who you are, and then you will find friends with those same interests. So. When's my next vlog video? Should be Saturday. Should be Saturday. Ooh, yummy leaves. We like yummy leaves. Can we see your poodle dog? My poodle dog, like Peach? You wanna see Peach? Peach. Peach, Peach, the people want to see you. Luna, they didn't ask for you. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Peach is like asleep. <laughs> Peach, wake up, Peach. She'll watch, she'll like put her head back down in a second because she's like, mm mm. Yeah, see, I know her. I know them so much. Now we've disrupted Luna's nap, so she's gonna have to go squeeze and get back underneath the couch. Come here, Luna. Little big yawn. So cute. Luna and Peach. Luna Bean. Hi, honey. Give her a little scratchies on the head. You, I know you guys can't see her. She's down here. I'm petting her. So sweet. Come here. Not feeling too athletic. You just woke up from a nap. Same. I get that. I'm never feeling athletic. All right, guys. We've done 60 golden leaves, which we love. Um, I love you and your video so much. I'm so sorry for everything. You're going through a mental illness. Hi, that no one knows effort. Oh, thank you. That's so sweet. Yeah, luckily, um, I am diagnosed like panic disorder, uh, which has you know I, i've always like struggled with anxiety we just didn't know what it was when i was a kid um so i was recently diagnosed after talking to a psychiatrist and she's like oh you have an issue and i was like ah, you don't say and um now I, I am on medication which has made my life a lot easier to deal with <laughs> it's just you know it's better who was my first video what do you mean I don't know what you mean. Who was my first video? Like, when was it? Um, it's on my channel. There's kind of some a few months before that. I actually used to film YouTube videos in the eighth grade um, with my friend Sydney. We had a cooking show and I have no idea where that channel is now. I cannot find it at all. If I ever find it, I'll share it. It's your birthday on Saturday? Well, happy early birthday. Oh, you're in the eighth grade. You love all your teachers. That's fantastic. You like my shirt? Thank you. It's my first time wearing it. I was nervous to wear it because I wasn't sure how it was like gonna fit, but um, I'm liking it. 
I think it's cute. I like the color. It's so bright and fun. Oh boy. Does Pancake have a channel? Yes, he does. Pancake does have a channel. Um, it's Pancake Plays. And he is creating a lot of really fun videos daily. So you guys should definitely check it out. I don't, I don't know the name of the cooking channel. I don't remember any of that. If I find it, I'll tell you guys. But it was just me and my friend messing around <laughs> and creating cooking uh, videos. <laughs> So, and we don't know how to cook, so it was just, that's why it was funny, because we don't know how to cook. Uh, <laughs> it was eight years ago. Um, it was definitely over a decade ago. I'm 27, so 10 years ago I was 17. So in the eighth grade, that's probably like 15 years ago. <laughs> what are the rarities of the butterflies? Let's go look. So here we go, you can see them here. The yellow butterfly, 60%, scarlet, 37.5%, purple, 2.5%, orange, 60%, green, 37.5%, and a diamond, 2.5%. Um, so obviously the golden leaves, they are 200 Robux a piece, and the regular leaves are 900 bucks a piece. The best deal for that is to get this 650 Robux pack. Um, you will only be able to buy one of them, but you will have 500 bucks left over. If you buy two of these, then you can get three, I think. Hopefully that was helpful. Hopefully that was what you were looking for. You get made fun of for the way you talk and try to make new friends and feel like they will just stab you in the back like people did before. I'm really sorry. Um... I wish I could say that it gets better <laughs> in that aspect. It's really hard to know who to trust. I thought I had a really close friend and then I found out a bunch of stuff and now I'm like left kind of hurt. Um, and people still do talk. People do make fun of the way that I talk still. Um, but I have grown to be very confident in who I am um, and you will too. And stuff like that won't bother you because if people are picking on you for the way that you talk or the way that you dress or the way that you look, like, that's a problem with them. You know what I mean? Any new tattoos? Nope, no new tattoos. My mom, my mom is, my mom's pretty freaked out with the, re the recent ones. Megan, you need to throw a normal leaf. You can't get the purple from the golden. I, I know, but I, I... I'm trying to throw 100 golden leaves. So maybe I'll throw some more purple or some more regular leaves if I'm feeling like it. <laughs> what did I want to be as a child and why? Um, I did not have a lot of aspirations as a child. Uh, so that's a little bit difficult to answer because I didn't really know what I wanted to be. So. How many are left? We have 19 left. 19 left. I got a diamond. Yeah, I, I've actually gotten a surprising amount of diamonds. I'm really, really excited. Like definitely more than 2.5. So that's super exciting to me. I'm gonna go ahead and pull out this pet. I'll equip it. I'm gonna change its name back to just normal so it falls into the category with the others. So we can really see like the proportion of the pets that we got. Um, and then I'll change it back. So. You're bullied for being skinny and was sad. I got bullied a lot for being skinny. I was um, 90 pounds through high school. I just had a really fast metabolism. And people would tell me things like, nobody ever is gonna love you. Nobody wants to date a stick figure. Um, and then it, it's so funny. Everyone would be like, eat a cheeseburger as if that was like an insult. And it's like, I do, I do eat. Um, and I think that making fun of anybody for their body is really bad and mean and no one should do it because you don't know what people are struggling with. Um, if they're struggling with like an ED or if they're struggling with, um, just self-confidence issues, body dysmorphia, 
Like you should just never comment on anybody's bodies, whether you think that they look good, whether you think that they look bad, whether you think that they're too skinny or too big, no matter what, you should just never, ever, ever comment on anybody's body, no matter how close you are with them. Even if it's your best friend, do not comment on other people's bodies. <laughs> Happy birthday, everyone. Yes, it's everybody's birthday today, surprisingly. Um, got 12 left. You love my makeup? Thank you so much. Zach does not have a YouTube channel. Um, you are all beautiful the way that you are. You're beautiful with any, you know, just any, any, anything you feel like you're being bullied for, it's what makes you you, it's what makes you unique, and it's, people are really mean, and they shouldn't be mean, but they are, because they need to put others down to make themselves feel better. Your best friend keeps making inappropriate comments about your body, should you stay friends with them? I would say that it depends, one, how much you like them and how much you want to be friends with them. Because if you don't want to be friends with them, then don't. But if you do want to be friends with them, I would have an open conversation with them and say, hey, whenever you make comments like this, it makes me upset and uncomfortable and I don't like it. Um, so please stop doing that. And depending on how they respond, that's kind of your answer. If they're apologetic and they're like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, I didn't know. It won't happen anymore stay friends with them especially if they're true to that and they stop making those comments but if they react poorly and they tell you that you shouldn't be so sensitive and you should get over it um and they continue to make those comments then you should not be friends with them because they don't respect your boundaries you only want to be friends with people that respect your boundaries okay guys four left four left okay we got an orange guys we're like so close i can't believe we've already done 100 of these i mean we have been streaming for like close to 40 minutes and like i said i thought that's like kind of about the time it would take so it's pretty exciting <laughs> Okay, so let's do this last one and then we'll calculate and we'll see how close we got to the actual um, listed rarities. So that's very exciting. Let's see what our last one is gonna be. I got so many diamonds, so I'm very, very happy and grateful. This is gonna be so much fun. Okay, so let's take a look here. So if we take a look, we got 49 green butterflies. We were supposed to get about 37. So I'm happy with that. We were supposed to get 60 orange butterflies. We got 43. So we got really, really lucky. And we got eight diamond butterflies whenever we were only supposed to get two to three. So right now I would say it's a good time to buy butterflies because I think the waiting might be a little bit off, but it's in a way that benefits you because <laughs> these are these are harder to get a hold of the green and the diamond so that's so exciting oh my gosh let's do a few of these leaves because i need to try to get a purple butterfly because if i can complete my collection today that would make me so happy i'm so sorry that you all are struggling with being bullied <laughs> really tough I know just hang in there and it will be okay I promise you because things that seem like a really really big deal right now in a few years they will not even matter a hill of beans that's what my mom used to tell me they wouldn't matter a hill of beans and I didn't really know what that meant but um yeah those people they don't matter to me they matter to somebody they don't matter to me anymore <laughs> You spent 5,000 trying to get a purple and you didn't get one? Oh no. Oh no. 
Okay. Uh, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Okay, so all the tips I've given, all the advice I've given, it applies for every grade. It applies to me right now as a 27 year old. It applies to no matter how old you are or what you're going through. If somebody makes you uncomfortable, tell them. If they don't respect that, then just know that they don't respect your boundaries. So if they're a friend, they might not be a real friend to you or a good friend to you. So. You spent 20K to get a purple? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, we just need the purple, guys. And I think we've spent well over 100 leaves. I'm gonna have to add all these up because we did 100 golden leaves, but now we're doing the, the regular leaves. Okay, another Scarlet, we'll take that. It's time for school, sorry. You don't have time for school. We have time, we're trying to get a purple here. Another Scarlet, very pretty. You got a purple from your third leaf. That's awesome. Um, what kind of music do I like? Well, I have a public Spotify, so you guys can always listen to what I'm listening to. Um, my favorite bands are Bring Me The Horizon, Ow. My Chemical Romance, I really like, The Neighborhood, I really like, Poppy. Those are all like my top five. I really like Lana Del Rey. I really like, um, mm, 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 mm. oh no, I like a lot of stuff. Come on, purple, come on, purple, please. Come on, purple. Purple, purple, purple. Okay, Scarlet. We don't have a purple yet, but we're, once we get one, our collection will be complete. I'm like kind of cheating to see, <laughs> to see which one I'm gonna get. Cause look, as soon as you throw it out, the one you get appears. Like you don't have to wait for the animation. You can throw it out and that one's gonna be Another Scarlet? Oh, dang it. But now it says I have 13 of them. Is it just because I have it equipped? I can see these moving, but I don't, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, another yellow. Okay, so then the yellow comes. So we have 13, 13, and then yeah, 13 and 13. So throw that out, we, we're getting another yellow one. <sighs> yeah, I'll be giving out some butterflies um, in public servers a little bit later today. Like I said, I have to record another video, so I'm not gonna be on directly after this, but um, I will be on later giving out butterflies. So make sure you're following me on Roblox so you can join when my joins are on. What made me want to be a YouTuber? Well, I never like wanted to be a YouTuber. I just started uploading videos as a hobby because um, I thought it was fun and I saw the people doing it and I thought it would be fun. Um, so yeah, I just kind of fell into it. What color braces should you get? Uh, you're a fan. I know I'm a fan of hot pink, but you're not too in love with pink. So besides that, well, when I got braces, I think I did a lot of, um, you know, you obviously want to avoid green and yellow because they can make your teeth look dirty. Um, you also want to avoid white because those can get dingy. Um, what about blue? Like if they have like a turquoise, that would be really fun. Um, I've done that one before. I only had to wear braces for under a year, so I didn't get to try out too many fun color combinations, but I'm gonna say like a turquoise blue if they have it. My favorite color is pink, but I like every color. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I like every color. Everything that is bright and colorful, I love. So. <sighs> Come on, we really need a purple. <laughs> We're really grinding for it. Do I think Olivia Rodrigo is a good singer? Yes, I do. I think she's very talented. Whether you like her music or not, she's a talented singer and you cannot deny it. I do like her music though. <gasps> purple! We got it! We got the purple! Yay! 
This is so exciting. This is so exciting. This is so exciting. Oh my gosh. We just collect, we just, we just completed our collection. Hold on. Oh my goodness, guys. Take a look at that. That is so exciting. Oh my gosh, does my merch go to the UK? Yes, it does. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. Orange is a good brace color, braces color. That's good to know. I like the color orange. I used to not like the color orange, but I think my favorite color schemes are becoming like this, like orange and pink. I mean, I even got my nails. I even got my nails orange and pink. See, because I really like the orange and pink. Um, so I'm really into orange and pink. I like it. I mean, I even did my eyeshadow like yellow and pink, so it would be orange in the middle. So. I do like that. I do like that a lot. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for watching today's live stream. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for hanging out with me. I hope that we all had a fun time together. I appreciate talking to you guys. You guys are the best part of my day. Thank you guys. I love you guys so much. Do not forget to hashtag stay PG, stay kind, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye. Have a good day.